What's up everybody? Okay, so we're gonna do a short video today. This is uh, something I'm gonna try to start doing when I can so the the videos are gonna come out when they come out so don't expect anything you know too fast. Uh, these are just you know my ideal builds for certain characters. Some are mostly finished, some still are in works. Today we're gonna be doing the epic build series for Craw or Crow, however you like to say it. Okay, so first off, uh, the artifact is something, you know, uh, it, it doesn't matter that much. Um, I use this uh, Justice for All. I use it for PvP, Guild Wars, uh, P PvE content. Uh, this is an all-around kind of build. It works for everything. Um, plus 5 for uh, his first skill. Second skill is plus 5. I would like to actually max those out. Um, and then of course this one, I still would like to get that maxed as well, but just have it on the plus one for now. So here's the thing is you'll notice his defense is almost 2000. So that's really good period all around his health, 18 K that's fantastic. His defense is something you want high for his S2, you know? And then his health, obviously, for his S3 and his S1 is proportional to his health as far as the damage goes. I mean, that's just an all-around good build. Not super fast. So, you can see he's got plenty of defense, plenty of health. So, him not being fast works for an all-around build. It enables him to use his S3 when need be and have taken enough damage by the time it's his turn. You know, you're going to get get work out of it. Um... Critical hit chance, 51%. That's not, you know, great nor bad. It's something nice. You know, his critical hit damage is up a little bit. Nothing major. His effectiveness is only 21%. But it's that effect resistance you'll see. That's 65%. So, as you can see, as as, as far as, like, a, a real tank build, this is a pretty solid build. Uh, you may disagree. You may agree. Um, maybe you don't have something this good. Maybe you have something better, you know. Uh, this is just there for for you to see maybe it helps you maybe it gives you ideas on how to maybe build something better for yourself uh he is fully awakened uh six stars um i do want to change his uh weapon out to something better but for now you know i'm still using this as you can see that effect resistance 22 percent that's a big part of uh why i'm still using this small health increase there um this is a great helmet he he got lots of good health out of this um and some more effect resistance defense then, of course, as you can see here, this is where I pick up some defense and health and effectiveness. A very good piece for him. Also being that defensive uh, set, an extra 15% defense there. Let's move on to the necklace. People will be like, oh, you got a crit necklace. Why? Because this is why. 50% more defense. Health, 22%. Most people automatically would probably see this and be like, oh, that's a terrible piece. Well... On certain units, it absolutely is. On this unit, it's absolutely great. Like I said, you just got 50% more defense plus the initial flat 23. You know, you got 22% more health, some more effect resistance. It's perfect for a tank. It's perfect for this build. I couldn't be more pleased with it except for to have a higher one that did everything else and more. Bam. Another 50% defense increase on top of a defense ring with 15% health, a little extra speed, and more effect resistance. This is where these pieces come in handy, where you're kind of like, eh, this isn't that great. Well, start looking at your units and think, oh, this piece really is great for this unit, for this build, for whatever it is I want to do. The boots, health, 60%. So that's where a big chunk of extra health is coming in at. Um, not an overall great piece, I would say, but, you know, it threw up some attack, a little more effectiveness, you know, some base health. Um, critical hit damage, you know, and then of course, you know, the initial 60%. So, I hope that helped you out. Maybe you like my build, maybe you don't. Uh, if you want to leave some comments down below or got any questions or, you know, just want to chat it up, you know, do so. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, kind of like what I'm doing, uh, you know, I try to put video videos out when I can. Um, you know, go ahead and subscribe. Um, and we'll be back soon. Uh, well, I say soon, but I got some work to do. But I'll be back as soon as I can with, a, with another epic build. So take care till then.